This is the Muscle D Elite Leverage Abdominal Crunch Machine. It's actually one of my favorites and I'm gonna show you why in a second. So first of all, we have ergonomic perfection. It's able to hit multiple parts of your core, your obliques on both sides with several adjustments, which I'll show you in a moment, and also the top, middle, and bottom of your core, depending on how you use it to activate. So let's get into it. First and probably more obvious, a lot of machines don't have these long handles, but these are great. So you can hold at the top or the bottom, depending on how difficult you want it to be. The top is less difficult, and as you go back, it gets more and more difficult, and you have to really use your whole core. Second, we have the traditional ab crunch with your legs right underneath you, and then we have a wonderful pivot feature. So instead of pivoting the top, we can actually pull this handle at the bottom, and we can move from right to left. There's a total of one, two, three, four, five little slots for you to put it into. So traditional and then slight variation to target all different plates to really cut up your stomach. Okay, but there's more. So we have wonderful stainless steel holders. Depending on the overachievers out there, we can stack the weights, several of them on the side. Just for reference for this video, um, the, the demos that I'm doing, I'm using a five pound weight and that is very challenging, especially when you're doing anything past five, six. And finally, we have this wonderful part right here. It gives lumbar support, which helps put your body in the perfect position to get the true targeted ab crunch. So overall, when you sit in here, to get back to my point of how do we get the different parts of the muscle, well, this is sim more simple. You're able to either pull first or pull your legs first and then pull the upper body. So watch this. If I pull here first, I'm already pulling down and I'm hitting right about in the middle of the stomach. Let's say I want to activate the legs first. You can't actually do it with just activating the legs and just, unless you have a super stomach, but I, I wouldn't worry about that one. So if I'm going to pull my legs and then pull with the handles, that actually gets a little bit lower on the core. And then if I want to go and do a super crunch, I'm actually going to move my hands all the way back, which then elongates my stomach and creates a more intense crunch. So I lift and I have to pull from the top and then squeeze all the way down. So it just essentially increases your range of motion. That's some of my favorite features. Hope you enjoy this machine.